Hi, hello, and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Tanya. For those of you who are new here, welcome. And for my returning subscribers, welcome on back. You guys are fabulous. Some of the topics that we cover on my channel are true crime, chronic injuries and illnesses, prosthetic eye, current events, family dramas. We do um, trending topics, makeup reviews, makeup tutorials, um, and just so much more on this channel. And a little life vlogs. We do so much. We really do. If you are wondering where my girls have been, which are my dogs, they will be back in next, my next video. I promise. I'm just in a different room than them right now. That's all. If you like today's case coverage, I really hope that you'll consider subscribing to help my channel grow, hitting the bell icon to get alerted to all new videos, and if you're feeling really generous today, maybe you'll hit that like button as well. It's all free and it all helps grow my channel. If you would like to donate to help my channel grow, I do have a PayPal and a Cash App and both the names on those are Titanium Built. You can donate as little or as much as you would like and I just want to say thank you ahead of time. One last thing before we get to today's video, I just wanted to say if you have any questions or comments and you don't feel like you can leave them in the comment section or you're just a little nervous, feel free to email me at titaniumbuiltboo at gmail.com with any questions, concerns, or comments that you have. Let's get on with today's video, shall we? I have seen a lot of videos stating that the Kylie Rodney case must be a criminal investigation and not just an accident. This is based on law enforcement's ruling out of Jagger Westfall as a suspect in the death of Kylie Rodney. Other content creators are saying there has to be an active investigation because they're ruling people out. They cleared Jagger and it must be a criminal investigation because they are clearing people. I think that they're clearing people or putting it out there that these people are cleared because, and this is my opinion, because as of right now, we haven't gotten any update from law enforcement and we probably are not gonna get one until November 1st, like a real big update. They are putting it out there, right? This is how I feel. So that these people that are cleared, so that the internet and the internet sleuths will get off of these kids' backs, right? And maybe leave them alone. Maybe leave them alone. If they haven't done anything wrong in this case, that's, that's not too much to ask, you know, really. From the beginning of this case, these kids that are involved are not involved. There is a group. We have Sammy, Kate, we have Kylie there, we have Mags, we have Jagger right? we got five people. They are all friends. Kylie's not here anymore. Jagger's been cleared. I don't know. I am sure that law enforcement knows that Jagger Westfall was not in the vicinity though of that party and that's why they cleared him and only him. They had to have had significant call data, location data, to say, okay, he was not in this vicinity at the time, between whatever time and whatever time they're putting it. They have to have something that they're gonna, they're just clearing him, okay? They cleared him, they cleared him. But Sammy, Kate, and Mags, not cleared. These kids are probably, most likely, actually I'm about 100% positive that they are getting threats. So even if this is all so called out to be an accident in the end, they want to roll people out so that those people can move on with their lives. Roll them out, sorry. They want to rule them out, let them move on. I think they're doing this because they're not giving us any information as of right now. You know, they're just, they're not. They've given us Jaggers cleared, that's it. That's all we've really heard since August. Police are trained to think that whether it's accidental, suicide, or homicide, when they come on scene, they are trained to think and treat a case as a homicide until otherwise determined by those detectives through evidence collection. So if they are doing their job right and their due diligence, and I know that we've seen a lot where they have not been doing it right, but if they are, 
they are going to be rolling these people out that way those kids can move on with their lives the internet can get off their backs and then we can move on but they haven't cleared sammy mags kate and i'm not sure why if you guys know drop that in the comments below but this one's a hard one you know i say this after every video it's really a hard one every morning i wake up or this afternoon when i'm done eating lunch or this after dinner i see something different i see something new and i see something even more incredible than before so i'm just going to be following this case very closely like i have been and be bringing these updates to you guys as soon as they come out and make sure that you're hitting that subscribe button and you're um, hitting the bell icon that way you're alerted to all my new content because i am posting every day sometimes multiple times a day so you want to make sure that you're getting alerted to all those um, new videos thank you so much for spending your evening or morning or afternoon with me and i hope you guys have a great night or morning or day and i will see you guys in my next video much love guys don't forget to add me on social